me, Mari from Soul Style Beauty, and today I'm talking about social media because social media is wonderful, but then it's also some things that I totally hate about social media. And I was like, maybe that would be a fun um, video to do because I know that we ball, we ball. <laughs> But we all use social media. We all use it and it literally runs our world these days. Since it runs our world, I thought it would be a totally fun idea to do a video. And also I'm collabing with two of my girls here on YouTube. They've been with me basically from the beginning. Their names are Nina and Barry. So they did the same thing, five things that they dislike about social media. So go over to their channel, show them some love, tell them I sent you, and definitely subscribe. Ah, social media. Say, oh my gosh, so much things that I want to tell you guys today and so much that I have to say about social media. But first, let me take a selfie. Okay, so let's cut the nonsense. The first thing that I really hate about social media is false validation. There are people, broken people, and I'm not mocking help and they need everyone to pray for them. But at the same time, it's like they find their worth in life. And I cannot stand this. And I feel like I see my younger girls doing that too. And me seeing that makes me so upset because I'm like, lights. <laughs> Looking from my stand standpoint, trust me, if lights paid my rent, honey, trust me, I would go above and beyond. But I'm telling you now that they do absolutely nothing. They don't validate you. They don't determine you know how big your accomplishments are and I want my young girls to listen to this when I see people having like thousands of likes and it's like strangers and people are getting this like false high off of those likes and it's kind of like you need to find your worth and I feel like social media sometimes that's where people's worth lies in social media and likes and to me that's one of the things I really hate about social media because now not only with social media are we getting less social but at the same time people are finding their worth and strangers okay so the second thing about social media is we always feel the need that we need more right we go through these little boutiques we go to our favorite beauty bloggers Instagram or Twitter they have any product that they're representing and we all of a sudden need it I hate it because it makes you broke Okay, so another thing I can't stand about social media is internet bullies. Everyone so-called can say whatever they want, even if it's like disrespectful, and I really cannot stand it. I know that I got a lot of YouTube comments that were like hateful and said nasty things. I remember this girl in one of my videos, she was like, you know, your hands were kind of ashy in the video, and your face was a totally different color from your skin. It was just kind of distracting. And that was a video about um, moving out of your parents' house. And I'm like, really? Like, where did she get that from? Like, to be real, where did you get that from? At the end of the day, it's like, you clearly wasn't watching for that. So, stuff like that, I just really hate that about social media because it's not so easy. People think it's easy to put yourself out there, but it's not. And then you have people coming at you sideways who barely even know you from a hole in a wall. It's quite annoying. So that's another thing I cannot stand about social media because it's kind of like this free-for-all, go ahead and throw a nasty comment whenever you feel down about yourself. Because to tell you the truth, hurt people hurt people and that's what these people do. But that's something I truly dislike about social media. Another thing that I personally cannot stand about social media is those sharing posts. Like share this in 120 seconds if you love the Lord. Share this in 20 seconds and you will go to heaven. Trust me. If it was in God's will to share some posts to get to heaven, I'll be sharing 10,000 times a day. It's just, I just don't like those posts. I think it's just one of those things where it's like leading people down the wrong path and like messing with their mind. Like, I hope these people really don't think that. It's not that easy, but I just hate those posts. Lastly, another thing that I dislike about social media and individuals who use them sort of in a way is that they make themselves this, this type of idol and I just personally I've always been a humble person no matter how big my accomplishments are or what I achieved in life I've always been a humble person you need to humble yourself it's a lot of people on social media who are not humble and I hope you feel me on this one because this one is like something I truly dislike everybody wants to be in this 
high throne, but at the end of the day, who got you there? Who gave you those gifts? Most importantly, I just want to get down to that. Who gave you those gifts? And God gave you those gifts. So it's like if I'm taking all the credit, I think it's something wrong with me. I just tweeted this, so follow me on Twitter, guys. But I wrote, um, I just really pray that no matter what I achieve in life and how successful I am, that I remain humble. Because once you start letting your pride take over, you become a totally different person. Trust me. So, yeah, I just wanted to leave you guys with that last message. I hope that you guys really enjoyed this video. I tried to mix a little bit of like comedy and humor into like the serious motivational stuff that I wanted to get out and get out something of substance. So I hope that you guys really liked it. I had fun filming it. And also don't forget to check out my girls, Nina and Barry. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.